Hey everybody, it's Wellens. We are checking out Shadows of Doubt today. A few of you suggested this one to me, and it sounds really interesting even just from the description. It's apparently an immersive sim that's procedurally generated in a sandbox noir city where we are a detective trying to solve crime. Some of these things I feel like sound like they should be at odds. Usually immersive sim I think of handcrafted environments, but procedurally generated? Sandbox? Well, it sounds interesting already to begin with. One thing to note though, this is currently in early access, so expect stuff like bugs to pop up. And I've actually come across something already in my setup pre-testing. This game has some issues with stuttering if you're running it on higher resolutions, like 1440p and above. If you look on the Steam forums, there's quite a few threads about it. I have a 1440p monitor, but I'm playing this on 1080p upscaled right now, just to guarantee that I won't stutter as much. So that's something that probably people playing on higher resolution monitors should be aware about before they start playing. The Dead of Night, a specially crafted case to introduce the game. Yeah, sounds good to me. But we can also just do normal sandboxy stuff. We will play in a pre-made city. Just one, Charlotte Heights. City size medium, population 326. I don't have concept of whether that's like a lot or I guess that's medium. <laughs> it's medium. Hmm. Now I'm okay with leaving this all on default. Oh, wow. Okay, there's a lot of money, lockpicks, procedural murders. <laughs> Procedurally generated murders. Flickering lights. Yeah, I- hold on. I wonder if we can do like a- let's do a short game and see if we can maybe do like a short tutorial length thing. Yeah, there's a lot going on here. We'll just leave it all on default pretty much. Okay. It is the late 20th century. Hyper-industrialization has swept the planet. The old Bourbon Empire has crumbled, giving way to the United Atlantic States and the first elected megacorporation president in history, Starch Cola. <laughs> Mr. Cola? That's his name? A sea levels rise. Cities have become polluted islands. Workers dream of escaping to the fields, an exclusive retirement district few will ever see. Where people are sectioned off into different districts. Rival corporations vie for power, policed by the privatized Starch Cola enforcers. Now the corporation is basically ruling the town here. They're the government. Basically, too long didn't read, everything sucks. Some say justice now only exists in the shadows of doubt. <laughs> 303 Gomez House, the dead of night. Is that a 1? I-04 AM? 104 AM. Awake again. So cold. Just can't get used to sleeping without Sam. No use just lying here. Oh. Run. Crouch. Jump. Sam. My partner is Sam. It's a gender neutral name, so I don't know if it's a... A man or a woman. I'm Sophie. I'm a procedurally generated Sophie. Final notice, open immediately. How do I open it? Oh. Uh, if this icon's present, it means you're interacting with this item directly. In world, as opposed to from memory. More actions may be available to you while interacting with it directly. Okay. There's a lot going on already. This is open already. 
Is it already open? How do I read this? Western District Special Police Service Commendation awarded to Sophie Edwards for outstanding investigative duties. Fine clearance rate. Dedication to duty while assigned to the 169th Subdistrict Homicide Department. Me! I'm an awesome detective. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's like this, um... These pins here? Oh, what the heck? Right, right, right. It's actually quite like, um, you know, when you when you see shows, they have the detective pin board, the cork board. I guess that's what this is simulating. There's me. I don't even know anything about myself, <laughs> besides for my own name. Because it's got to be about logic and all that. Yeah, all right, gotcha, gotcha. Is that the letter? Wait, how do I open this letter? It just says open letter. It looks like it's open already, because the... This is the envelope. And it's opened up. Whoa, I'm getting so... Hold up, there's... There's a lot. You know what, maybe we'll, we'll come back to this. Turn on the light in the lounge and in the kitchen. Maybe it's summertime. Gotta rely on the fan. It's rainy, dreary, noir city. I live in kind of a crummy apartment. It's locked. It's mine. I should know the code. Passcodes in Shadows of Doubt are always a four-digit numeric code. If you're lucky, you'll be able to discover them by finding various notes. Is this 0451? <laughs> Maybe let's not try it. We'll see. Oh yeah, I can touch like everything. Hold up. Did I look at the one on the bottom? Okay. Oh wow. Storage box. Files! Files. Tenancy agreement. A citizen profile can be built using unique traits. Their full name, their voice, their photo image likeness, yada yada yada. Tenancy agreement. Drawn up between landlord Emily Pysik and the tenant Sophie Edwards about where I live. 303 Gomez house. Show on map. Okay. There's a person, my landlord here. We know that she's a landlord. Salary, handwriting, passcode? Am I to understand that every single person who lives here probably has these characteristics? That's crazy. This tenancy agreement... Yada yada yada... The key must be delivered. Well, we live here. We're living here fine. All- everything that's broken has to be replaced by the tenant. It's a great contract. But you can't repair it or replace it without telling the landlord. The tenant shall keep in good repair all walls, tiling, flooring. No painting. Don't alter the walls. Don't encourage or harbor pigeons, rodents, or microscopic life forms of any kind. And call pest control upon first sighting. Do I have to tell you first, landlord? No subletting. No drying laundry. <laughs> no nails and walls. Well, this is kind of standard for an apartment, I guess, but... Yeah, it's karma here. Oh, the garbage bin is for dry trash only. No organic matter. No moss, mildew, or mold. For any purpose, including nutrition or recreation. Moss? Moss or mold for recreation? <laughs> oh, more than one patch of living matter will incur a financial penalty. Any change in employment must be reported immediately. Failure to notify the landlord or bureau inside 24 hours will result in immediate eviction. Oh my gosh. No explosives. No visual media relating to a rival corporation to any surface. Like no... Ri uh, what was the corporation name again? Starch Cola? Or was that the president? <laughs> oh. Hmm... 
only one corporation rules everything here. <sighs> this is a long contract. No wearing stiletto or noise making shoes in communal areas. Oh my god. Jeez, man. Okay. Oh. Cool. This one's locked. Oh my god, we're gonna be here all day long. We can open every single drawer! Nothing in there, though. Can I sit on the chair? No, I wanna sit in it! I wanna sit in it! Damn, this chair is kinda crummy. Micro Cruncher! Yes, yes! Oh! Crunchers are digital personal computation devices. They're common in most apartments and white-collar workplaces. If you know a passcode, you can log in. You might be able to find a lot of information inside. Okay. CCTV cameras have two functions, to alert instances of security threat, but it also captures surveillance stills throughout the day. You can use the ladder for information. I don't know my own code. I don't want this to actually be 0451. <laughs> it's not. I don't know my own code. Okay, we'll come back. It's kind of creepy. Well, it's 1 a.m. Maybe that's why it's creepy. Whoa. All right. You want to grab a cup of water from your nightmares? This is not a very efficient use of your apartment. It's pretty roomy, but you got this, like, area here doing nothing. Uh... Yeah? Hello? Who is this? Okay. Well, that was fantastic. City directory. Oh, wow, we can find out where people live like this? If we know someone's name. Sam? I wonder if Sam's dead or something. Better Champion Corner, Beta Enforcer Division. What about my landlord? Her last name was a P? Where does she live? Yeah, yeah, Emily... Pysik? Novak House. Now I know where you live, lady. How do I pull up the... My inventory. I've got... Coin? Fists? Watch? Nothing? You know what, maybe I'll just let the tutorial take me through. <laughs> There's a lot going on here. X. Right, these are locked right now. Check the time, or use to pass the time when sitting down. You can fight people with your fists. You can use coins to create distractions. Officially a credit, but colloquially known as a crow, thanks to the image of a bird on the side. Okay. You have access to a city district map that lets you toggle, or that you can toggle in the top left, or you can tab to see it. Search the apartment for clues. It is currently Jan- wait, is it currently January? Because I can move between. I guess it's January? Unless if I'm such a slob, I didn't rip it off. Oh. Sophie, I set the password back to 1234. Take care of yourself, Sam. Who is Sam? What is Sam's last name? What is this stuff? Oh! Oh, that's really cool. Toggling between handwritten and... Yeah, it's good for people with, like, dyslexia and stuff. Sweet. I don't know what this, uh... <sighs> hold up, hold up. Okay, I have some... Flashlight. I've got a pretty special looking painting here. You can see the flashlight. <laughs> it's like a mirror. Hairpin. 
Keep a lookout for paper clips and hairpins. These can be used for picking locks. Cool. Can I sit? I'm sorry, was there something... Was there something under the door? Hairpins. Wow, my own house is so interesting. I'm never gonna get bored of looking at this. Oh god. Whoa. Ooh. Oh. Air vents, huh? It's like a immersive sim special. Immediately makes me think of Deus Ex. Do you want to grab a cup of water? Isn't that what people in the movies do? Oh, I, I've been having nightmares. I gotta go have a drink. CZX2 battery. A standard CZ carbon zinc I-O volt? Oh, 10 volt battery. Often used for powering handheld devices such as remote controls or radio. Oh, don't take it. What's this? Case board. When you inspect an item, it brings up its evidence window. This can be pinned to your case board for future reference using the pin at the top. Pinned items are displayed as icons that you can drag and move around on the board. You can position these items any way you like and select them to bring up their evidence window. Facts or connections are displayed as string. You can mouse over these to see more info. F to see it. Find Oni Johnson. Pin it. This is a job. Someone's telling me, do I not work for the police anymore? Usually, we wouldn't be getting jobs like this, right? <laughs> uh, pin the note to your case board using the red pin. Close the board. Ani Johnson? Never heard of him. If this is a job, it's a lousy way to do business. Yeah, I don't think I'm working for the police anymore, but what was that call earlier? So these two don't have like a... Um... Oni Johnson. Okay, person I'm trying to find. We got a letter. Saying I should find... I can create a string. I see. I don't think we need to... What's this note? Find him. What's this one? Oh god. Buttons. Oh, it's right here. Okay, we don't need this one. This is the one that's a commendation for me. Okay, we just need these two for now. Soap pads. Trash. Search. Search through my own trash. Cleaning spray. Used for cleaning surfaces. <laughs> Just leave this stuff here, whatever. Starch candy screwdriver. That seems like it'll be useful. Hiding place! Oh my. Depending on your activity, different kinds of status may affect your character. These are displayed on the left of your screen. If only Sam could see what I'm doing right now. I'm going insane checking on my own house. Salt. Okay. I have limited inventory, right? I've only got four slots, dude. I can't be picking up random salt. <laughs> Fists. Okay. Key. Key for my house. Paperclip. Eraser. Or I can... When things go wrong, fight. Yeah. Uh, why is it locked right now? But I can select it. Yeah! Money for everybody! I'm not limited? Okay, cool. Oh, good lord, it's been an hour already! I better get going. Uh, let's go, let's go. Should I take a screwdriver? That seems like it'll be... Good for screwing and unscrewing screws. <laughs> Whatever, take it. P-O-W-A, Former Police Officers Welfare Association, we're here for you. Free basic housing for those in need. For more information, contact Beth 
Gallagher. Please note, we can no longer help with money or social credit claims. Oh damn, I'm retired and I'm doing bad. I'm doing bad. Oh, there's a bathroom. There's no water in the toilet. Can we close the blinds? Oh, we can. Oh my gosh. Yeah, well, we don't want creeps looking in in the middle of the night. Can't shower, though. No mirror. What do I look like? A medicine? Painkiller produced by Amori Pharmaceuticals. Would that be good to take? Splint? Support a broken limb. Bandage. This seems like it's more useful than... Assault. <laughs> Maybe I should... Drop this? Oh, I'll take one. Okay. Thank you, my own home. Oh! Is there kind of a mirror here? Yeah, there's a mirror inside. Cool. Okay, anyway. Anyway. Uh, city directory. Oh, no, no, no. Hold up, hold up. Hold up. <laughs> you know we're never gonna do the objective, right? We just gotta... Hold up, okay? How do I... It's... One, two, three, four. Yes! Yes! Yes, now I know things about myself! <laughs> oh, my own phone number. That's probably good to know. I don't know my face, though. I don't even know half the things about myself. I'm a young adult. Cool. V-mail. Happy New Year, Beth Gallagher. Ah, the Welfare Association lady. Probably BCC. It's 1979. Yeah, 20th century. Dear Sophie, Happy New Year from everyone at the former Police Officers Welfare Association. We hope you are finding success in your alternative career. We would like to remind all members that the Enforcer Crime Report Boards in City Hall remain open for public... ...viewing, and will be updated regularly with open and unresolved cases. Remember, we're here for you, your friends at the FPOWA. They're legally obliged to state that we have every faith in starch colas, enforcers, put some life into it, and their ability... Oh, they have every faith in the starch cola enforcers, put some life into it, and their ability to maintain law and order. Beth Gallagher. Oh, maybe... Maybe the police department got downsized because the enforcers are like the new police now. I can print it. Why? It's a waste of paper. I'm already... I'm already poor. Oh, that's cool though. Sweet. Yo, they have the printer just completely stuck to the computer. We should have that. Why don't we have that? Sam Merriweather. Last things. What date is it today? It's January 3rd. 2.40 in the morning. Hey, Sophie. I filed the papers to take my name off the lease for the apartment. I'll send my new address when I can. Don't forget to keep up with the rent payments. I'm sorry it had to end this way. Take care of yourself. <gasps> Sam, no! Why'd you leave me, Sam? We have a photo? It says photo, yes. Another young adult? No, that's me, that's me. I clicked on Sam, but it opened Sophie. Right. I guess Sam is not important. Oh, if you read it on the computer, if you print it, you can click on it and stuff, I guess. Is this one also 1234? Oh. Okay. Genome DK and health risks in hybrid synchronization packages by Professor Sam Umeki. Unofficial translation. What the heck? He's talking about genetic sequencing. Hey, so this is in real time right now, which makes me wonder if I should really be reading any of this because people in the city are doing their own things as I'm doing this, right? I just realized the coins I threw. It was a hundred earlier. I gotta go pick it back up again off the floor, the kitchen floor. <laughs> um, gene therapy. Okay. Codebreaker. 
Oh, damn it. Knew I shouldn't have picked up a whole bunch of crap. A bar of sweetened chocolate. You want to eat it? You can't even eat it. Take the code breaker. Is that it? I guess so. I'm just going to leave random crap on the ground. Device used for breaking numeric codes can be used on keypads or even keyboards. Okay. Hold up, where's my coins? Thanks. Money can be used to buy items in the world, acquire genetic upgrades for your character, pay for information, decorate your apartment, or even buy a new one. Damn. I'm poor already, okay? We gotta... This is why I'm poor. I only have a hundred bucks. I can't even make the next rent payment. My partner left me. We just broke up. Oh, it's snowing now. Hmm. I wonder how Sam's doing. Did you ring earlier? Just outlet. You may find telephones throughout your exploration of the world. Each telephone has a telephone number, and you can perform several basic functions. Actions include finding out the telephone number, finding out who last dialed this phone, or calling someone. I have my own number. Enforcers. What's it calling the police? 911. Identify last caller. Wait, what's the... Identify number. The telephone number. That's that's my telephone number, right? We already know this, actually, because we read it already. Right. Ah, ah, it's like, um... Right, so these numbers... You dial this number to find the number of this telephone, which makes no sense to me, but I guess that's how that works. Is that how it works back in the day? Ah! 451. 541. There you go, there's a reference. Identify last caller. Oh, then we can find out who called us last. Last caller was this one at 1.34 p.m. This is probably relevant. Or maybe, yeah, maybe this one. This one... We don't know anything about this one. Okay, I'll, I'll keep this one for now. There's a phone... Oh yeah, we can go in. Okay. Somebody called us. It might be related. Um, can I... Call that number right now? I don't suppose... They'll... Really, you know, pick up or anything, but hey, we gotta try. they're picking up. It's 3 a.m. Hello? Okay, so this might mean that no one's even at home then. No one's even next to the phone. Or maybe they're just ignoring me. But I feel like if there was a person, they would at least pick it up and hang up so that I would stop ringing. So it sounds like the person is just not there. Uh, Jay? Oni Johnson? Who lives at 802 Rose Building. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna pin this one. And can I look up Sam Merriweather while we're here? They moved. I don't know to where. Are these all procedurally generated? Maybe not this one because it's a tutorial case. Yeah, there's like... Siblings, maybe? I don't see Sam here, though. Mm, whatever it is, I better go prepared. Okay. Oh. The key to my old police stuff was lost in the last move. But I could pick the lock. There's gotta be something I could use around here. Like the hairpins? Keep a lookout for paper clips and hairpins. These can be used for picking locks. Each lock has its own strength. When you start the process by interacting with a door handle or lock, the indicated bars will tell you how many picks you need to complete the lock pick. Okay. You can also use lock picks to sabotage security systems. 
7% two picks. Not sure if I understand the percentages yet. Oh, but I, I opened it. Okay. Um, Detective stuff. Yes, inventory X. The top group of items don't take up inventory space. These are vital tools. The lower section, however, is different. You can drop or scan picked up items for fingerprints once an item is selected. Oh, wow. You can assign hotkeys to inventory spaces by hovering over them and pressing the desired key. You can also view info about current status effects about how to get rid of them in the screen. 30 lockpicks! There's another battery here. Open the case board and select the pinned 802. Plot a route to the building using the button on the address evidence window. We're gonna go to find him in his own house? Well, I suppose that's a good spot to start. Wait, what, what did I pick up? What was the detective equipment? Print scanner? Is that new? Scanner that can be used to detect fingerprints and footprints. Okay, cool. Is that... Is that broadcast in Mandarin? Certainly sounds like it. Okay, well... Let's get going. Wait, you know what? We gotta turn off the lights. We're already not able to pay the tenant bill and all that. We gotta make sure we... You know... Oh god, turn off the computer! It's wasting electricity! We'll keep the lights on here, maybe. Oh! Hold up. Hold up. I don't have to pick lock my own lock. Right, right. Oh, you know what, though? I want to try something else. I'm gonna lock it. I want to try the air vent. You can travel through buildings. I'm trespassing! Through ventilation ducts. Simply open the grate, then select the action to climb through. Do the same to get out. Oh god, oh god. Wait, this is my own house. It's... It's my own apartment building. Oh, but this might end up going into someone else's house, I guess is the... Problem? Oh, if I get seen by the stuff colored in red... Bad things will happen. If caught, you will pay $50 fine. If you... If underlined, it means you have been seen. I haven't been seen. Oh my god, I have no idea. Okay, I can go up the vent. That's pretty cool. What in the... Maybe this was a bad idea. Where am I... These go... Okay, that's... Definitely somebody else's house. You know what? <laughs> where am I going? How do I... How do I get back to where I came from? I just... I just want to live a law-abiding life, okay? I used to be th with the police. I am not going to tarnish my reputation. I had awards and everything. Where did I come from? Oh my god. I'm so scared of breaking the law. Well, I mean, if something bad happens, all we got to do is kill the person who finds out, right? What the hell is that? Okay, this is my own house. Yeah, let's turn on some of the lights. Okay, maybe let's... No one's gonna come break in, right? I'm just gonna leave. What is that? Snack jar! The fridge! How could I have ignored the fridge for this long? Synth milk. Wow. Synth beef. Not suitable for vegetarians. Even though it's synth? Life in... Whatever, what's the name of the city again? <laughs> the Shadows of Doubt. City Shadows of Doubt <laughs> is not very pleasant. Yeah, I wasn't there. Okay, well, you know, I'm a, I'm a law-abiding citizen. I don't need to walk around like that. Ooh, should I? No, you know. <laughs> Let's go to Rose Building, shall we? What time is it right now? Jeez, it's like three in the morning. Hi, 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 neighbor. 
Evening. What's your name? My name's Antonio Walker. Cool. Do you, have you seen or heard anything unusual? Nothing. Do you know Annie Johnson? It's not enough information for me to help you. Because I only have a name, I don't even have a picture. Could you give me your fingerprints for an investigation? What? Oh, thank you. Well, I guess if it's for an investigation... Well, do you have spare change? Sure, anything to help. Oh man, you're, you're so kind. Thank you, Antonio. Which house do you live in? Are you one of my neighbors? Bye. See you around. Thanks. Thanks, man. It's like four in the morning and you just... <laughs> Maybe he was scared of getting mugged by me. I'm probably really suspicious looking. Hi! Hi. Hi. <sighs> Evening, what's your name? Sorry, that's personal. Oh, this person's not as nice. I'll give you $50 for your name. Screw that. Could you provide me your fingerprints? No way. So we can build profiles. Yeah, this person's not as nice. Okay. Bye. It's actually a lot of people walking around in the middle of the night. Right, and then if we... Person... let's see... Sync disks. DNA base upgrades. Yeah, there's some sort of like a cybernetic nature to this. I'm just wondering how we can find out all the things that we learned again, but you know what? Let's let's take it one step at a time. I'm trying to jump ahead here. I should be following the tutorial. It's just that you can look at everything, so I'm like, well, why not look at everything? <laughs> Whoa, alright. This way? Paganos? Why is it so dark? Because it's four in the morning. I don't think I live in a very nice place. Whoa, are you holding a knife or... Oh, you got like a beer? Inspect. Oh, I have a picture of them now. Female. Oh, I can, I can get like a full profile of them if I inspect them. Hi, miss. Evening, what's your name? Nothing to do with you. Have you seen or heard anything unusual? Nope. Could you give me your fingerprints? Not giving you nothing. That's honestly the correct move. But the first guy, Antonio, my man, he might have been... I just looked too dodgy. He didn't want to get hurt. Because he knows I've got the fists. <laughs> Dragon. It's snowing now. Sink clinic. Yeah, I think we can talk to, like, every single person here. And remember how there's 300 people in this town? I don't think we should be talking to every single person. It's 802 Rose Building. <coughs> it's a Chinatown here. What I wouldn't give for a cup of coffee. These people are short. Hmm. Should I inspect people? Hey, hi. Evening, what's your name? I'm not telling you. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. Seditious anti-corporate messaging. Remember, if there's other corporations, media from other corporations in your house, you're getting kicked out. Echelon game. There's like Chinatown around here. Rose Building, 8th floor. Their place doesn't- it looks marsh- wait, this place looks nicer. There's like security cameras and stuff. What, am I just gonna waltz into the place? It seems like it. 8 floors? Is that an escalator in the middle? Elevator, I mean? Uh, I would like to take the- I don't want to walk eight floors. Eight. But presumably we could have though, which is really cool. And there's stuff on all these eight floors. I 
I'm legally here. This is a public area. Oni? Oni, where are you? 424. Rose building. Uh, to know if a door is locked or not, you have to try it first. Locked doors can be unlocked by focusing on the door handle. If you have the key, you can unlock it. Oni? Breaking and entering. When breaking into a room, it's a good idea to check for cameras. If you are worried about them, you can turn them off by using the security breaker box connected to the camera. You can trace the red wires to find these boxes. They will need lockpicking. In residential properties, it's worth checking under the doormat for a key. Most rooms will feature some kind of ventilation system. When struggling to find a safe entrance, this could be a great way in. If in a rush or out of options, break down the damn door. This might take several attempts and it's very noisy. So I need to get rid of this... This red... Oh, there's a breaker box right here. Oh, there's an, is it okay though? Because can they see me here? Illegal action. It's only illegal if someone sees me. Yeah. Is someone gonna know though? Oh, maybe not the lights. Oh! Is that a good or a bad thing? Because it might stop me from leaving as well. Okay, well, maybe let's... Okay, there's also a vent here. Okay, th there's my escape, okay? If anything bad happens, there's my escape. And I hope this person is not home, for God's sake. Because I'm... I'm breaking in. <laughs> oh, I don't... I feel like that's not smart. Let me just check again. So one was for the cameras, one is for the door. One is for the lights. The cameras are off, which honestly I feel like the security guy would be like, Hey, why are the cameras off? And they would come running. How do I see... Okay, uh, no one has seen me yet. They don't know I did that, right? If I leave, they don't know I did it. Four locks. That's a lot. Maybe I should have tried the vents? Oh, we got in. If you find yourself somewhere you shouldn't be, you'll gain a trespassing status. If it appears in orange, citizens with authority will ask you to leave immediately. If it's red, they'll kill you! <laughs> they'll attack. So just as you may want to be careful about entering, it's often a good idea to identify means to help you make a safe escape. Keep an eye out for air ducts you can escape to in a hurry. As well as hiding places like under beds. Doesn't seem like he's home. TV's on. Scout laser. Matchbook. Usually there's an address on the matchbook. That's how these things go, right? <laughs> Got a lot of matchbooks. I'm just curious if that's... Don't think I can get on top of that, though. I don't think it's on. No! We're here for a mission. We don't have time to sit down. I didn't actually check under the carpet here. Was there a carpet? Oh my god. Yeah, this is a tutorial. I should have... I didn't have to lose the lockpicks like that. Oh well. Address book. These are like... His friends or something. I guess. Some people live here. Okay, cool. Um... My god! Hello, Identify the body by finding a photo ID. Wait, wait, wait. 
We gotta make sure the whole place is safe first. One second. Oh my god. Are we safe? No one's here. Is that Oni? Take print. Cadaver. Unknown citizen. We have his print. Search? A bullet wound from low caliber ammunition. He was shot. Oh no. From examining the body, it appears that the victim has been shot to death with a pistol or revolver. I can determine the time of death is between 0.15 and 1.30. Oh, that's when I woke up. Tuesday, January 3rd. Probably let's pin that. Who is it, though? We don't know. We just know their face. We know their fingerprint. Look around for vents for a potential quick exit. Yeah, yeah, I got you here. Okay, so I got that. Identify body photo ID. Tonight, you need a piece. Go to Cotton DIY Company, knock, then give the password Mulberry V. Mulberry V. Tonight? Is that relevant? Oh, seems like it is. Oh, it's a note found here. They automatically create a thing for you. I see. Okay. Safe code, 1428. Okay, so this was already like this when I got here. Someone was going through the drawers. Oni Johnson, office manager, Goldburn Technologies. Office? Fingerprints. Each citizen in the city has a unique fingerprint. You can scan them using the fingerprint scanner device in your inventory. Point the scanner where you want to scan. Almost all surfaces contain fingerprints. Unknown fingerprints will be found in sets, with set A being the first you find. Any matching prints will also be labeled to that corresponding set. For example, if you find set A at an apartment and subsequently at a bar, you can prove a citizen was in both locations at some point. Use right mouse button to inspect fingerprints after you found them to pin them to your case board. Fingerprints may disappear over time. Okay, so we know his job as well. Yeah, it is Oni then. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, this is linked to everything. Hold up. So Oni works at Goldburn. That's Oni, all right. I should search the place for clues. Work, Rhoda. Works 9 a.m. to 17 o'clock. We can check for recent calls on his thing. Okay. Select your print scanner. Scan for prints. Okay, hold on, hold on. There's so much to learn here. Oh my goodness, I'm trying to like keep up. His wallet. Take the key. Take the money. I'm sorry, Oni, but you won't be needing that money anymore. No hard feelings, right? Oops. Voice? We don't have his voice. He's 53. We learned it from his ID. We can probably get his phone number by checking the phone. Handwriting. Sample type E. So we got the key. We actually have two keys then. Can we turn this off? Was he watching TV and then somebody came into his house, maybe? He wasn't even cleaning up anything. Ooh, what does that say? The New Leaf Association for the Legally Challenged. We are a friendly, non-judgmental group welcoming all those who wish to become productive members of society. Our advisors can help you return to work and begin making social restitution payments with our fabulous New Leaf, New Me, six-step program. Legally challenged? What does that even mean? I guess I'll keep it for now. Legally challenged. Did I take it? Lucas Lucas 
Whoa, what does that mean? Oh, if I take it, then maybe someone will know, huh? As opposed to right now, if I have it on my board, I know about it. I wrote down the information, but I didn't take it. Okay. His work ID's everywhere. Why does he have multiple work IDs? Can knife. Take the knife. Take the knife so we can have a weapon. Handcuffs. When did I get handcuffs? You work hard for your money. I don't know. Make it work hard for you. Just ask your work I think we should hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Take care of the rest. Can, can I drop the screwdriver? Scan the screwdriver. What did that do for me? <laughs> oh, that's probably my fingerprints, right? Because I touched the screwdriver? That seems pretty likely to me. The code breaker? I'm trying to scan it, but... It doesn't always let me... Arresting! Once you've figured out the culprit, you may want to perform a citizen's arrest. To do this, you'll need handcuffs. You can find them at the vending machines at City Hall. <laughs> you can find... You can find handcuffs at the vending machine? Approach them from behind? And focus on them. Oh, okay. Once arrested, citizens are much more likely to answer your questions. After about two hours, any cuffed citizens that are not reported will be freed. You'll need to acquire their name for the case form objective to recognize that you've completed the arrest objective. Okay? Okay, not yet, not yet. Okay, you know what? This is just... I'm gonna, I'm gonna take that knife instead. Oh, the scanner. Hold up. Right, the scanner. Each citizen in the city has a unique print. This... You've already gotten... There's... How do I... Oh. Yeah, it's Oni's fingerprint. Makes sense. Because he was touching the phone. Right? First of all, we can find this number. Right, so now we know Oni's number. Do we not? We know this number, but it might not specifically correspond to... I mean, it does. We know it does. But I don't know how to get it in here. I click on it. It still says question mark here. Okay, forget about that for now. Um, last person who called? Last caller. 5153499. Should we call them? Is this is Yeah, it was uh yesterday? Not yesterday as in a few hours ago. 515. Oh, but they also have like a um, address book here. Is this someone we know? Five one five. Wait, wait. The phone number is. I was looking at the address. Five one five. Oh, it's this person, Violet. So make it work hard for you. Just ask your work about our paycheck exchange program. Maybe this is the person we want to keep here then. And then I will phone them. It's worth checking out the address book. They're not picking up. Whoever this is, I'm not interested. Evening, what's your name? I'm not telling you. I know your name, it's Violet. Have you seen or heard anything unusual? As if I'd tell you. Okay. Okay. I guess we're not getting much information here. But if we really wanted to, I guess we could visit that person in their house. They live at, yeah, Stubbs Deluxe. If I really wanted to. Which, maybe let's put that on hold for now. There's a lot, hold up. This is me, so I'm not gonna, I'm gonna ignore that. 
Violet. Okay. Duct tape. Can I really not turn this off? Sometimes it's useful to search the trash. Hold up, hold up. Looks tidy here. Crumpled paper. Receipt, keep for tax records, Jade King Lounge. Not paid at the tab. This is from last year. Probably not relevant. I, I don't think it's relevant. There's gonna be stuff to try to throw me off, right? Ooh, this is open already. Let's try to get some prints first, if we can. It's his. Inspect fingerprints afterwards. Mm-hmm. Did Oni open this? Sync disk upgrade vial. Code breaker. I got a code breaker already. I guess I'm supposed to maybe find somebody else's prints here. Better use this print scanner to scan for anything that Perk might have touched. Type C! So this is interesting because it's the first time we've seen it. And I guess we should put it down here then. These prints don't belong to Oni, and nobody else lives here. Take this vial to a local sync clinic and upgrade one of your installed sync disks. Seems important. Whoa. Wait, why is there like a... Theft! Wait, someone saw me steal? How come there's a underline on the stealing? I'm trying to figure out- there's so much to learn here, I'm just like, oh my god. I drop this. Oh, now it counts as vandalism! What the heck? Who saw me? Who saw me? What? I was curious why there was a thing on it, though. Like, why was there... the little... is it because it's a weapon? It doesn't actually say. But I touched it now, I can't just drop it here, because they're gonna think I killed him. Because <laughs> I touched the knife! Oh. I think I'm gonna maybe... I don't know, man. Okay, you know what? I'm flustered right now. Hold up. You see prints on it? Okay, it's just Oni's own prints on it. Okay, cool. I guess I'll let the knife here like that. <laughs> totally looks like the killer left it here. Books? Are you sick of being stuck on the ground trying to climb the greasy pole? Videotape? Do you think we can find another set of prints? Yeah, this is all just Oni. Oh. Oni, employment agreement. Yeah, we know he works there already, so I don't think... He got his signature. Wait, oh, Johnson! Come on, this is Oni Johnson! Why do I have to... What?! This is Oni Johnson! Is this supposed to be like that? These should be the same thing, right? I don't know how to match them, though. Forget it for now. Don't think this is important. Yeah, 1 out of 23? What? That's wrong. Charlotte Heights Opticians? It's an eye exam? Tenancy agreement? Oh, we have the same landlord for some reason. Oh, maybe the landlord is... Someone we should be paying attention to, huh? Sounds like she probably owns a whole bunch of stuff here. Certificate of birth. We now even know his blood type. But the telephone number, I'm not sure how to... get going properly. Anyway, I don't think this is all relevant. Remember your passcode this time, 142... I didn't even have to... it was already open. It was already open. Business card. In multiple ways to find the same information. Don't forget who owns you. Whoa. 
Whoa, can we do a fingerprint scan on that one? Don't forget who owns you. Should we take it? Let's take it. Illegal action. Illegal action? Oh, illegal action isn't I can't do it because I have too much stuff. Oh, because this is stealing. This probably means I'm stealing it. Oh, I've got too much stuff. I don't have the inventory. Well, we have the note, so maybe I don't need to take it. Diary. Monday, 11 p.m. This is supposed to help. The group leader said so. Don't know what I'm supposed to put down, but Kiara said it sounded like a good idea. Kiara. Everything sounds like a good idea when she says it. Trying to cut down on starch. Not easy. Seven cans today. Starch cola. Thursday, 9.45 p.m. Good day today. Went walking with Kiara down to the water. Even saw a bird. Felt like a normal nobody. On a normal afternoon. Cans of starch, five. We'll do even better tomorrow. Friday, 1 a.m. Violet called. Today's Tuesday. Should have known it wouldn't be this easy. Meeting tomorrow. Cans of starch. Ten. He's stressed. He's taking it like a drug. Try to get out. Said I didn't want to do this anymore. That I was done. But Violet just laughed. Told me it was in my blood, like the starch. Hope Kiara's safe. Shouldn't have told her anything. But they knew something was wrong and we said no secrets. Wish I'd kept my goddamn mouth shut. She won't pick up. Want to head over there. Violet might be watching. Makes me sick. No choice. Got to. This one I can't take. We can't take all of them. But we have the information. Violet and... Kiara. We know where Violet lives. How do I make the connections though? Because we, we definitely already have a Violet here. But does it view it as a different Violet? Okay, forget about the landlord. Yeah, because this is clearly the same person. But we don't know. We don't know for sure yet. Maybe that's why it's separate. Kiara. That seems like important information to know. Oh, I just... I just took the pills. Am I okay? I guess I'm okay. I have... $5,000 in theft. I better get the hell out of here soon. I was just randomly under the bed, too. Shoes. Kind of dirty. There's cockroaches all over the place. These are just novels. It's hard to, um, I guess kind of like real life-ish. You have to pick out what's important, right? And not every single thing that we look at is going to be important. There is a freaking hammer! Okay. Search. Apple. Don't think we need that. Shouldn't we call the police? But they're like starch cola people. Dirty napkin. Crumpled. Ew. Crushed starch cola. He was stressed and drinking. Cola. Junk. Don't think we need that. A lot of cola. Receipt from Indigo Hair Kitchen. Keep for tax records. Oh, this was last night. This one might be relevant. Stealth and combat. Uh-oh. Not being seen is your best chance of survival. The central cursor displays the information you need to stay hidden. The dot in the very middle of the screen displays how hidden you are. A hollow circle means that you are completely obscured. Others will only see you if you get extremely close. Filled in circle means you are completely visible. The color of the outer eye shape displays if someone or something can see you. Uh-oh. Why are you telling me this randomly? You can punch or block. Okay. Uh, be careful, detective. Violence can escalate quickly. Why are you telling me this? Hold on, before we go... No... No, the tax record might have been relevant. The silent alarm has been tripped! Means enforcers will be here any moment. Oh, jeez! Oh, Wait, I wanted to look at this! Kiara! 
Kiara! Oh, yes, we need this place for Kiara. Okay. Open the door immediately! Can't be found here. They'll take me down. The receipt is from Indigo Hair Kitchen earlier this evening. Let's, let's get out of here first. Oh my god. Are they, are they in? Oh, <laughs> someone says. Oh, someone's sleeping in their own room. Hey, we're orange now. Because now I'm just trespassing. I'm just a random person trespassing and... Yeah, I, I'm just hanging out in the vents. I'm not a killer. I mean, I still wasn't a killer, but if they found me next to Oni like that, probably pretty hard to convince them I'm not the killer. What the? What is that like somebody's house? Where am I right now? I don't want to... Hold up. Okay. That's a gun. That's a whole ass gun. Um. Can we just leave this place the way we found it? <gasps> you are Marita Purse. Hold the phone. Oh my god, Mana. Mana, you know what? Nobody will notice. Nobody will notice. You are Marita. I think they live here. It doesn't matter. Can we get- oh! We're in 503. She works elsewhere. Forget about her. Do you think- I hope they're not home. Miss, I'm- I'm not here to- I'm just here to get out. Uh, I have the key, so I can just unlock this and go. Oh my god! Oh my god! Which is the way out? I just want to leave your house, okay? I'm not here. I can't- okay, you know what? We have a map. We have a map. I know we have a map. Where am I on the map right now? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know! I just want to get out. Ma'am? I am not here. To... hurt you? Oh, that's me? That's me? The way out? Is I think we're right here actually. Wait, is that is that still her apartment? If we go straight out, this door. I I live here. I live here. Why are you? Why Why would you? <laughs> <coughs> You know what, I'm, I think I'm gonna take the elevator. I don't really fancy walking. Okay! Oh! Ah, and then as soon as we leave the building, all the trespassing stuff goes away. Fantastic! Okay, collect the murder case resolution form from the city hall. Murder case resolution? Already? Must be the rats. Stop following me. Who the hell's following you? Do you own the place? God. People are so paranoid. Hey, what's this? 
Oh, people live here. I see. Wow! Are there really, like, every single room in the apartment? Could we really go in? That's... Maybe that's why <laughs> there's the stutter issues, because that's actually pretty insane. Fish market? Casino? I, somehow I doubt there's a casino here. <laughs> it says casino here in Japanese. Fish market in Chinese? Damn. Um, who's paying me? I know I got this job from a random note, but who's paying me? Like, why am I doing this? Because I wanna... my skills are rusty. And I wanna... practice them. Keep myself occupied. No, I want money, because I'm poor. Can I look at the map again? Oh, like this. Oh, sweet, okay, there's actually like a line. Cool. Yeah, I can imagine... Oh, cold, I'm cold. <sighs> Gotta get warm. Yeah, if we don't have to have loading screens or any of this, I can imagine this game getting pretty... intense. In terms of the performance and stuff. Is it not warm in here? Oh, hi, 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 hi! Evening, what's your name? My name's Jasmeka Vincent. Oh, cool. Do you know... Oni? I saw them somewhere around Rose Building. Oh, wow. Have you seen or heard anything unusual? Nope. Oh, it's a random person from City Hall. Thank you for the money, thank you. I kind of feel bad for the person whose house I randomly invaded. Get lost! Damn. Damn, man. Here, can I take that? Cool. Thanks, man. Oh, uh, I'm here for a form. Collected form, dead of night. View your case objectives by using the resolve button in the top right of the case board screen. Resolve button. To resolve the case, provide the answers for the following before plotting a route to hand in to the hand in destination. Mm. Oh, I see, I see. Okay, but we don't know. So if we know it, then we can fill this in. But we don't know it yet. Uh, we have several leads, I think. The diary was a pretty big hint. I could pay a visit to Goldburn Technologies. That's where Oni works. Or used to. Oh, sorry, I'm a, I'm a woman, I forgot. Or I could check out Indigo Hair Kitchen. Oni must have been there recently. Pretty recently, actually. Like, right before he came home. In Shadows of Doubt, there are almost always multiple ways to carry out an investigation. Here are the currently available leads. Choose one as a start to be guided through. Remember, in the main game, you'll have to think for yourself, detective. In addition, due to the simulated nature of the game, some leads could be dead ends, just part of the job. If you think you have enough information to solve the case, fill in the resolution form using the button in the upper right. I want to investigate a weapons dealer. Is that the, the diary thing? Cotton DIY company is supplying weapons to whoever killed... No. No. F1? Oh, okay, fantastic. Ah, oh, so the address book. I read it already. I don't think I had to go back specifically. I want to go chase down the people that were mentioned in the diary. Because that seems like the most suspicious to me. And then maybe the, um, the diner that he was at right before he died. That could have been interesting too. Ki let's have a let's start with Kiara. Do you think we can find information like that? Novak house? So we, we plot a route like that, right? Although it's like seven in the morning right now. Police officer. You can search for public or visited locations. Yeah. Okay. I'm not cold anymore because I went inside. Jade King. Oh, I think Oni went in here earlier. Novak House. So how'd I go here? Plot of route. Okay. And of course, I mean, this is just me choosing to do whatever. You certainly don't have to do it like this. That's the freedom! 
Freedom of immersive sims and whatever. Whoa. Novak House? 402. Ki Kiara wasn't answering. 402. Oh, I should have taken the elevator. That could have been Kiara for all we know. Why don't you leave me alone about it? A uh, fight breaking out? Gotta stop. It's bad for you. There are some really short people here. And that cola ain't? That's not what I'm saying. Wait, this is the floor. Are we... Who are these people? It helps. You know I got a promotion? Yeah, but for how long? Who cares? I care. Well, you shouldn't. I'm no good. <laughs> Is this like an AI-generated conversation? <laughs> I don't know what that is. Hi! He's gonna keep talking here? Stay here and talk to me. About what? About nothing. About anything. Doesn't matter. <laughs> I just immediately leave. Hi. What's your name? You don't want to tell me? Oh shoot! Oh no, I accidentally gave them 50 bucks just to tell the name! No! Okay, well, do you know Kiara at least? Or do you know Oni Johnson? Saw them somewhere around Rose Building. Damn it! Give me your fingerprints. Right now. <laughs> Hillary Fatopoulos? Do you know Kiara? Oh, there's many different Kiaras. I know somebody with that first name. Kiara Simmons. Yes, yes. I saw them around Novak House. Exactly where we are. Thank you. Bye. See you around or something. So these people do all have their routines. They go around doing stuff. Hillary. A lady just went past me. Did they go up or? Novak House. Someone is coming to answer the door. Hi? Probably Kiara, right? What is it? Evening. What's your name? Hello, I'm Kiara Simmons. Have you seen or heard anything unusual? Nope. I need to- Okay, do you know Oni? I work with him. That's Oni Johnson. They work at Goldburn Technologies. Yeah, I think you can tell the way they built this is- Yeah, they- It's sort of- These are not handcrafted conversations. They were near Dragon Burger. These are- the conversations are made so that they give specific locations and time. But I gotta warn you about the killer. Oni is dead? I knew something bad was going to happen. You have to help. Oni mentioned someone named Violet Diaz. Last name. I think Violet's a hired killer. I once saw them at that place, Jade King Lounge. You have to stop them before they come for me. Here's 200 crows that Oni left me. Also, there's a sync disc in my mailbox for Oni. Take it. I don't want it. Jade King Lounge. We were just there. So I think if we want to be able to resolve this... Okay, first of all, we can probably arrest them and all that. But the evidence is the fingerprint. So we're gonna have to go to where we find Violet. And then 
nail them down with the evidence and we know where they live. The murder weapon is a... It's... We know it's a pistol. So if we go to the weapons place, we could try... It's not... It's optional. We don't have to... We'll see. The specific murder weapon, though, I would be inclined to think either Violet... Okay, if it is Violet, she still has it on her, or it's like in the garbage dumps in the building somewhere. Good luck. Boy, in your mailbox. Where's your mailbox? Can I come in? Oh, it's locked. Where's your mailbox? It's a whole ass sentry gun. Oh. Okay. Violet Diaz. Do you know Kiara? <laughs> yeah, I think... Oh, hey, 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 you were like... Oh, you're an older... Evening. You're not telling me your name? Okay. Have you... Do you know Oni? You saw them around Stubbs Deluxe? Stubbs Deluxe? But Oni lives at Rose Building. Do you know Violet? Do you know Kiara? Right, you live here with Kiara on the same floor. Okay, I think that's all. I haven't been at the bar, but you've been at the bar. These are just random people. Hmm. Let me just go back down. Right, the mailbox. Uh, whoa! Oh, I, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Uh, hi. 60402? Uh, I can't take it. Sync this upgrade vial. I think we need this to make the arrest, so I can't take that away, but I just don't have enough space. Guess I gotta drop the painkillers. That seems like- I didn't even use the code breaker at all. Sync- Visit a sink clinic to install the sink disc. How about we do that first? Dragon dog. In Chinese. <laughs> Not like a hot dog, but a dragon dog. Um, if we take too long, what if the killer kills... Yes, yeah, so I don't know. Sometimes I'm like, oh, should I really be spending time doing other stuff? I'm not 100% sure. Can I zoom out? There was a sink clinic next to where we lived. Maybe what I can do is... Let's see. F1. Oh, the search takes a while. Let's see... I know where I live. What? I can't go there? Can I do sink clinic? Sink. Sink Corp. Oh. Which one's closer? I'm gonna bank on this being closer. I don't actually know. Let's go. Oh, it's right around the corner! Fantastic. Hi! Hi! I want to install some discs. Uh... By myself? Okay. Increase maximum health by 20% or increase inventory capacity by one. Oh, freaking give me the inventory capacity. Today. You can't change this unless if you reinstall another disc. Thanks. Spend an upgrade while upgrading the sync disc. Yes. Yes. But how long did it take? Right, now I... Yeah! Oh, I got so many more slots now. Fantastic. Great. Is this okay? Can I look at this? Saki Inoue. 9919. I know where you live, literally. Where is she? Oh no, I shouldn't have closed it. Because now it might... It might go back to the password screen. 
Yeah! That was dumb. Oh no, that was really stupid. Shoot. S can I try it again? Was it 9919? Oh shoot. It didn't actually- You know what, this isn't- This isn't relevant though, this is a random citizen, so I think we should- The door code. <laughs> People leaving codes left and right! Okay, but yeah, this isn't relevant. It's- It's fine. Let's go. This is just me being nosy and wanting to look around. There's a camera there, we probably shouldn't be doing anything dodgy. Okay, now that we have a lot more space... What am I gonna do with it? Probably nothing? Mm, let's go back to- I'm sorry, that keeps happening because I- Whenever I press tab, it shows up for like... A second really quickly. <laughs> okay, okay, we gotta- um, First of all, we know where Violet lives. Do you think we should try to find her there? If we go to her house, a thousand percent we're gonna find her fingerprints. Like a thousand percent. Right? We don't even need to use the city directory because we know where they live from Oni's address book. Supply and weapons. This one could be worth in looking into. Hmm. Let's go to her house. But it's like in the morning right now, so there's a high chance they're there. Kiara did say, oh, I saw them at the Jade King Lounge. Oh, it's right here. Might be a nicer kind of place. Marginally. If I can just like, get some fingerprints, we're good. Hey, usually this kind of thing, would we like wanna... Um, oh, I wanna go to the 12th floor, so I'll actually press 13. So that people can't trace me, and I'll walk one floor down, something like that. Wall floors, it's fancy building. Okay, if anything bad happens, we have fists. I lost my chef's knife earlier, but oh well, I guess. 1202. Hmm. These are like. Centuries. Yeah, that's what I'm a bit worried about. Not the lights. Of course it's locked. But how do we want to get in? We just want to go in through the front door? There's not exactly any... People walking around makes this kind of hard too. Vents? Ventilation? Well, if no one's looking... You saw nothing. You saw nothing, right? It's just that this apartment seems very cramped right now. So this is kind of dumb because we're going to the killer's house directly. Without knowing if they're even there. First of all, let's scan some stuff. Scan the door. Do not touch the freaking. Whoa! 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 Okay, you know what? Hold up, hold up. Uh, I'm just gonna arrest you for now because I need to. <laughs> so she was home at 8:30 in the morning. Why aren't you at work? You should be at work. Oh, because she was at work yesterday, killing people, that's why. <laughs> okay, hold up, hold up. How do I open my inventory? There's too much stuff overlaid on top of everything. So I'm gonna need you to... 
Okay. Let, let's fight. Let's fight. Okay, let's get back in your house. Why can't I get my... I can't get anything out. My fists. I can't unlock my... There we go. Oh, because I accidentally undid the thing, that's why. I can... put six on this. Okay, I'm gonna beat her up and then... Whoa, 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 whoa. Beat her up. And then we'll see. Ah! Now, now you're scared? God damn it. I'm countering them. I don't know how the thing works properly. Dude, I think she's killing me. Gotta pick up a kitchen knife or something. My painkiller is earlier. What the? Oh, I'm sorry. My screen lost focus for a second. What the hell? My face! Okay. Alright. Uh... Are you dead? Are you dead? You're not dead. Okay, thank you. Where am I? I'm gonna close the door first so no one knows what's happening here. What was that? Violet. Are you Violet? Can I just grab your prints? How do I... How do I get your prints? Are there no fingerprints on anything? Type C! There you go! Type C, right? Violet Diaz? We need something linking the person that we're looking at as Violet Diaz. Oh my gosh, this is so difficult to like... Because it's so easy to lose track of everything here! Hold up! Type C. We found it. Type C. Did we not find it earlier? B is me. C is the one at the safe. Are you gonna answer my questions? I can search her. She'll unarrest herself if I don't finish looking at my stuff. Gotta hurry up. Calligraphy set? Heat pack? That ain't it. Letter. Praise uncle. He will lead us to our Eden. Blood is sweet when it is shed with reason. Type D! Somebody else touched this! I think we were supposed to be able to interrogate her, but she didn't... She's not saying anything. <sighs> She's muscular. We even have an estimate of her shoe size. How do I ask her who she is? Well, there's gotta be like a work ID or something, right? Oh, there we go. Jackass. Shenren. What? Who is that? Oh my god. Shenren wallet? Am I in the right place? Is this... Oh, I'm taking the money for sure. Shenren? Is 
the city hall... There's a whole wallet here on somebody else. Okay, the wrench will probably be useful. Oh! Oh! Your husband. I don't have any other... I don't think I have another pair of handcuffs. Oh no. So we're just gonna have to... Oh my gosh. Dude, I have no idea what I'm doing. I'll tell you anything if you let me out. Will you really? How do I talk to you? I can't actually talk to you, can I? Look, I just gotta find something that says you're violet. Dude! There's a gun here! Oh, I probably should have picked that up for Prince. Sorry, I keep pressing the wrong buttons. Violet, there we go! There we go! Take your damn money! What is that? Organ donor. Oh, how, how nice of you. Very cool. Because we, like, harmed her husband. Do we have enough definitively to say that she did it, though? So we... We have the fingerprint sets, but it's not matching to the person? Because why? Because I need to, like, find it on the person? How do I get her print? Like, I'm staring at her right now, but... Can I get her print just by using the print scanner on her? She's gonna come up she's gonna be uncuffed soon. If we have the fingerprint to her, it's a done deal. Hairpin. Remember your passcode. 6096. K v D. Wasn't there somebody named V in the note at Oni's house? She like periodically forgets I'm here. I just need to match... How do I match it? Oh! Oh! Was I not supposed to hold the scanner? Is that how you get the print? Okay! Type C, there you go, we got it then, right? Yeah, hold on. Is that all we needed? Yeah, that guy woke up again, so I just punched him and he's he's spazzing up, but I think that might be... That might be it. Wait, this wasn't here before. I'm pretty sure. I had to reload because it seemed like... Yeah, maybe that was a bug or something or... I'm not sure. Anyway, um... Should I get out of here first? Because I feel like we don't want to stay for too long. Oh, what's this? Kiara Simmons! <gasps> this is the lady that... This is Oni's friend. So she might be... Violet might be really just a contracted killer trying to go around and kill everybody, but type E. Type E fingerprints. That's interesting. Hold up. Hold up, you know what? Let me just... I lock this. Let me get out of here quickly. And let's see. Do we have everything we need? Let's try to fill this out if we can. What's the full name of the killer? Violet Diaz? Arrest the killer, optional. I don't know if it counts as arresting her if I have her in the handcuffs. Only for two hours though. I don't know how long it's been, which is why I want to hurry up a little bit. Do you have evidence that places a killer at the crime scene? I should. The fingerprints. Do the lines actually... Oh, this is so messy, but okay, so we know that she is linked to the fingerprints. And the fingerprints were found at Oni's house. And not only that, the gun. The gun. Where does the killer live? Optional. 
The killer... Wait, is there a dress not here? Am I not seeing it? What? I We know her address though, or did we not find a document with her address on it? Um, is it okay if I just write it out? Is that alright? Because I know it's... 1202 Stubbs Deluxe. We can probably confirm this with other stuff, such as Oni's address book. Where is Violet? Wait, was Violet not here before? Whose address book am I looking at? I thought Violet- wait. This is definitely Oni's, right? Hold up. Address book found at Rose Building. For some reason, Violet's not here anymore, even though I was a thousand percent sure it was. Hmm. Stubs. Okay, so, well, there you go. I just wanted to make sure I spelled it right. Is it okay if I do it like that? It's 1202. Have you located the murder weapon? See, this part is what I'm not too sure about because I feel like circumstantially we do have it. It's the gun. It's the gun that was in our house. Especially because when we... Actually, can we find it on here? Because when we initially inspected Oni's body and mentioned that, oh, the ammo is a certain type. So if we can match that kind of ammo to the gun, then that would be even better. Where is the... Have you located the murder weapon? It's not clickable here. This one I can't just type in. I actually have it on me. It's Lazarus 5. Right, so this, see, this is a little bug I noticed. If you have the um, casebook open and then you have the inventory open, you can't really click on any of this. Little early access bugs here and there. You have to um, exit out of that. A Lazarus 5. Uses low caliber 8mm ammunition. Pretty sure that was in the report of us inspecting Oname. Oh. Hold up. Right now we have it like that. And then... If we scan it... Because I just picked it up in a hurry earlier. We know that this is Violet's gun. It's got the same type of ammunition as what killed Oni. And her fingerprints were all over the safe in his house. I don't think that's airtight evidence, but is it good enough? Okay, if I do it like that now. Do the lines actually matter or is it more for me? I think it really just matters that the fingerprint type C is now saying Violet Diaz instead of type C. So is that... is that good enough? Let me try it out. Oh god, I probably shouldn't be holding the gun like that. <laughs> mm. If we wanna get the optional arrest her objective, we probably wanna do this really, really quickly, because she's gonna... I can keep attacking the man, but she's gonna be out of her handcuffs soon. There's still a lot of different evidence pieces, though. Yeah, they were telling me to go look at Oni's workplace and place where Violet got her gun. But in terms of who actually was the one who did the killing... Well, I'm pretty sure it's Violet here. City Hall? Weapons locker. Oh yeah, we can... Right, we can buy all this stuff. That's good. Oh, ballistic armor. Handcuffs I think might be a good one to have a lot of. Just because like earlier, the husband keeps waking up to attack me. If I had to, then I wouldn't have to keep doing that, right? Let's see. 
I just submit it? Case processing. What's the full name of the killer? Arrest the killer. Alright, we did it! Okay, fantastic! Citizens can earn social credit for good behavior. Hey, I didn't see- I didn't finish reading that yet. Oh, $2,200! I don't even know who gave me that case. But hey, apparently that was good enough. I'm kind of curious though, if we go back to her house now, will she get like super mad at me or what? We didn't look at Jade King either. It's not open. Probably we could have like wrapped back around the back or something. Okay, this was a bit lengthier than I expected, even though I selected short game and all that. <laughs> but uh, interesting. I think we have a, a good bit of the beginning of what this might be like. There's so many little systems in place. I think it's actually quite difficult to get a handle on everything all at once. Hmm. My house? So I still wonder where the vent goes to. Oh, even my place is like... I live on the third floor, but there's so many... There's a lot of floors here. It's like a mega complex. Because we live in a very dark future. <sighs> Can't believe this. Repossessed. They warned me it would happen if I didn't make the payments. My house got repossessed?! The FPOWA used to run a flop house for ex-cops. I think the custodian's name was Beth Gallagher. Guess it's my turn to pay them a visit. Seriously? Oh my god! Wow! Whoa, what's going on here? Oh! This is my house. Damn! Whoa, they just took everything! Oh! <gasps> Take my bed with you, why don't you, huh? Yeah. Okay, so the previous case stuff, I think we can probably get rid of. Hey, this is still... it still works. Hmm. But not for long, though. They're gonna... freaking. Oh. But we can come back and use the directory, so that's good. Oh, there was an ad in here. The Fields, housing district for exemplary employees. Clean air, sunshine, with every place and external space. Zoned living areas for each family. Some opportunity for individual expression. <laughs> the Fields, for the happiest and best of homes. Register your initial interest today. Registration dependent on the financial and social checks and references. Only one registration of interest per household. Re-applications of interest will not be accepted. Interested parties must present valid corporation affiliate ID upon application. No mixed corporation households will be permitted. Wow! They're treating it like it's a mixed corporation households, like it's a race thing. Social credit. Hey, but I'm social credit level 3 now. You better watch out everybody, I'm, I'm level 3. Uh, okay, I see. So this is, this is one case, and it's done. But you can move on to more cases. It's not the end. Yeah, they mentioned the fields in the beginning before. It's the place that people strive to go to. But I mean, even just judging based off this ad, though, it actually isn't that great of a place. But it's still better than the hellhole they live in, which is the sad thing. Beth Gallagher? I just want to get a new home again first or something. Can we do that? Wait. Beth Gallagher? Oh, she lives at Stubbs! You're joking me. Is that okay? Can I go back there? <laughs> Find and talk to Beth Gallagher about accommodations. Okay, well, we'll spend a moment and see what happens. What's gonna happen with my accommodations first. This city has a few apartment buildings. Rose Building, Gomez House, Stubbs Deluxe. 
Judging by the names, probably it goes up. Wait, did you even... You didn't even... Stubs the locks. Did you plot a route or not? Please, plot a route. It's this way, actually. Judging by the names, house, building, the lux, stubs the lux is the best one? Oh, we're neighbors. We're very close to each other. But I'm not sure if I want to be back right here, right now. <laughs> 202? So something I haven't really been paying attention to is stuff like uh, the time? You could wait it out or something, right? If nobody is home, you may have to come back later, or find them. No, oh, she probably went to work. Well, I guess that's it then. I mean, I don't wanna... I don't wanna try to like... Yeah, she's not home. I've just gotta wait. It is what it is. Evening, what's your name? Hmm. Oh, I thought it was gonna be more like... You finish one case, and then that's it. And then you move on to the next city. But what it's looking like is we move on to another case within the same city. Which is why these people that we learn about, we still have information on them. Because, hey, they might come up again in some other case, right? Ah, oh, okay, okay, I see. Unfortunate that Beth isn't home, but it makes sense. Because no, not everyone's a bum like me. 10.30 on a Tuesday morning, they should be going to work. Mm-hmm. Well, I just finished a Hey! Well, not too bad, huh? We finished the job in less than 20, less than 12 hours, actually. We woke up at 1, 10 a.m. We're already done. Not bad if I say so myself. Can I archive? Answer these questions to resolve the case. Yeah, 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 I did. I did. But Beth isn't home, so that's that. Weirdly realistic, huh? You try to find someone, they're not home. Oh well, that's just how the cookie crumbles. We don't have cell phones yet, so we only have home phones and she's not home. Do we know where she works? Sort of, that like association probably, but do they have a building? That I'm not sure about. Maybe we could look up in the directory too, but <laughs> let's call it a day here. Interesting. I think you can tell they put a lot of effort into all the little systems here. The detective systems, the um, how each person's profile has a whole bunch of different things that make up what this person is about. Their name, their blood type, fingerprinting. There was even shoe size earlier, where they work, their phone number, their address, and all these little details. We got lucky this time because we happened to find the killer. There were four different leads. We happened to follow the right lead because of the diary. Because the diary seems so suspicious, right? But we could have gone to the company that manufactured the arms. We could have gone to where Oni worked. We could have gone to the bar, which... I guess could have been dead ends, or it could have led to new clues about where Violet is. Even the way we solved it here though, kind of get the impression it's not really the full story, because we did see multiple notes about a V, and okay, so Violet killed Oni, but what was really the motive? We don't know. That's not something the case resolution form asks for, so we don't really need to find out about it, but maybe if we followed those threads, the fingerprint type E, the V person, then we would have been able to find out even more about it, huh? I get the impression we haven't even dug into all the little systems they have here. Shoe size and blood type. I imagine blood type would be trying to find who some blood spill belongs to. Maybe the murderer spills blood at the crime scene and then you would be able to um, find something out that way. I think this looks really promising as a procedurally generated thing. The skeletal framework is all here. But I do find myself wondering how this game will stand up once the novelty of all the learning all the new systems wears off. Because it is procedurally generated, it's not handcrafted. Which leads me to believe that, okay, well, after I see all the templates, all the different types of rooms that can be generated, all the different buildings, will it start to get stale? Another thing that stuck out to me was the, the conversations with all the citizens around. Very, very cool that we can actually talk to all these people, all 300 people in town. But again, it's all about the templates. And they're all set up in a way to give you information or not give you information. Can you tell me your name? No, none of your business. Or, oh, my name is blah blah blah. Here's my first and last name. Here's my fingerprint. I saw this person. They were at this location at this time. It's super duper cool when you think about it in terms of a... 
at deducing a logic puzzle. But Shadows of Doubt, I don't think, is where we're gonna find... Oh, the emotional story of how Oni Johnson got murdered and why it was so sad and depressing and how I could relate to it as the, the audience of a story. But it's still freaking crazy what we've seen so far, though. And it really does seem like you can enter every building and every floor, every room, which suddenly makes the stuttering and the lack of optimization very understandable. Yeah, this is fantastic so far. It's a great little detective logic puzzler. Totally playable even in its current state and early access right now, if you can look past the bugs and the optimization. Mm -hmm. I'm definitely going to keep paying attention to this one as it moves further along development and towards full release. Really impressive so far. What do you think? If you've played this case too, do feel free to let me know what other ways we could have solved this. I mean, we did it, but the way we went to the killer's house and beat her up probably wasn't the most scientific and detective-y way to do it. Yeah, feel free to let me know what you thought about this game in the comments below. And with that said, this was Wellens with a first look of Shadows of Doubt. Thank you so much for joining me, and I hope you enjoyed watching as much as I enjoyed playing it. And I will see you all in another place, in another time. Bye!